Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. This news in the streets. Join us and tune in for the tea. Breaking news with integrity. So sell your friends and your family. It's the lovely T T V show. Bringing you good tea and good vibes. It's the lovely T T V show. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe. Hey, tea sippers! Happy Tuesday! I hope y'all are doing good today. So right now, once again, honey, our favorite people are trending on social media. Blueface is trending all over social media this morning, and it's a hot mess, but I'm here to break it down for y'all. If you guys remember back at the end of September, his mother, Carlisa, who gets on my damn nerves, she was running her mouth about Meg Thee Stallion and basically saying that she wants Meg Thee Stallion to have Blueface's baby. And a lot of people who were following her were like, Carlisa, you need to shut the fuck up. Meg Thee Stallion is not checking for Blueface. She will never have a baby by your son. And so, of course, she got offended and was like, y'all are acting like she's too good for my son. I uh, you know, started going off. So I want y'all to watch this clip from back on September 30th when she was talking about this. Check this out. Megan and Blue need to make a baby. Yes, I don't know why y'all was trying to act like she too good for my son. The bitch just got sh in the foot. Come on now. Stop f***ing playing with me. My son ain't about to in no foot. He might in that ass, but he ain't gonna sh in the foot. Don't try to play my baby like Megan too good for my son. Bitch, the last doing push-ups right now no offense no no offense i mean because my son been in jail i f with people i i, I the, the it's you know it's a serious situation but right now y'all trying to make it like my son ain't good enough for megan do you see me let's talk about it she she said you want to marry Blueface. i rather i would marry dre before i marry Blueface. No, huh? I'm just saying, look at Dre. Look at Dre. Compare y'all to my Mary Blueface. Look at Dre. All right, so you guys just heard what Carlita had to say um, a few weeks ago. So now, fast forward to today, Jason Lee um, had Blueface and Jaden Alexis on his show Gagging, and ooh, they were spilling some tea. So basically what went down is that Blueface, um, when Jason Lee asked him about the whole Meg Thee Stallion situation and his mom bringing it up, Blueface basically hinted that him and Meg Thee Stallion were together. And so Jason's like, what do you mean together? And he basically spilled the tea that he got some hit from Meg the Stallion. Y'all go ahead and check out this entire clip right here. What did you think about his mom wanting to hook him up with Megan the Stallion? What did I think about it? It was a clout reach. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean. The clout reach went backwards. Like, it's cool. I already been there and done that. Been there and done what? Exactly. Next question. <laughs> you slept with Megan? Jason, I didn't say that. Look at me. Are you saying you slept with Megan Thee Stallion? I didn't say that. Did he sleep with Megan Thee Stallion? I don't know, but it will really give me an Snow. insight if he do. If he did, let me know something. You said been there, done that. That's all right. Okay. I might have got some head. A long time ago. Stop. I don't, JD, you know about that, don't No, I don't. Why? Don't include me in that. You're talking to him. Don't include me in that. Like, a long time ago. Why are you looking like that? For real? Jason, I've been in the... Why? I mean, because I never I've gagged. I've been in the game in a long in time, Jason. Like, double XL freshman, like, five years ago. Like, BET Awards. Like, I know, like... Five years ago, <clears throat> I did all of the stuff already. I don't, I don't say too much, but you know, if 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 I ask, if you know, I will. You know, I'm gonna give you nothing but the truth. All right, see, I just saw the clip of Blueface talking to Jason Lee about his relations with Meg Thee Stallion. And Jaden Alexis literally sitting there unimpressed, looking like a damn bump on the log. So now what's even crazier is that messy ass Adam 22, he has literally come out of nowhere. Like literally, nobody, nobody, nobody at all. Here comes Adam 22 to pour more sauce into the situation. So Adam 22 basically took to his Instagram stories and he says, this is me when Blueface told me that Meg gave him top a few days after Tori shot her in the foot. 
So basically, he's low key confirming what Blueface said on the Jason Lee show. So this entire situation has just gotten even messier. And here goes a picture of him and Blueface together on his show when Blueface came to interview with him. Now, what's even crazier is that, of course, Krishan is talking. Uh, Krishan wants everybody to care about this relationship with her and Mabu so bad. Um, you know, they're going live. They're talking about Blueface. And she even talked about his interview that he did with Jason Lee yesterday. So y'all go ahead and check out these two clips of Krishan talking about the situation. No, I got I got in a little sticky situation with the other day. Uh -oh. When I was arguing with a nigga. <laughs> I think it's in the car, for real, real shit. Man, really was going at it, cause like it. this. He said, you gonna really let a white boy diss me? He ain't bought it. I said, bro, you really gonna let a bitch diss me? That's you. You wrote the diss. You could have at least let the bitch write. That's why I was like, my boo, write my shit, yo. Cause they're like, what the f my boo? Are you in the lab? <laughs> my boo. I'm in college. What the fuck? What is he? What? I'm in college, bro. Huh? I'm in college right now. Oh, alright, cool. But I'm just like, they thought they thought I was just gonna be quiet. Hey, Amen. Amen. Babu. Look, I like your lashes. Your lashes look good, man. Oh, thank you. You make sure right, you want you the left side. You the fucked up. Nah, we don't talk about that. You make sure you on the left side. You like your left profile, right? You on your left side. Right, I am sitting on my... How do you know? Oh, God. Oh, yeah, because we was filming. We... Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> I taught you that when we was filming. I said, no, nah, I don't like the other side. Cause I'm I, not growing my hair back. I don't like it. I have an ugly side right now. You know what I'm saying? I pay attention to the little things, bitch, huh? Boy, you know shut the fuck up. You and this little crushy <laughs> going on. What's going on? Yo, yo, yo. Let, let's show them where we made the song, though. You you did your verse in the studio, but motherfuckers, I, I sleep on the stoop. Like, gangsta. Like, I made Wait, it underneath yeah, my... I'm finna, I'm finna, I'm finna, I'm, we finna make some more music, bro. I'm finna come to your campus, bro. Yeah, nah, pull up tomorrow. Like, like that me. list shit you did with Fabio Four, and that shit was hard. It's broke. It's my fucking water. Yeah, he burst my kid, but I hate his power. I use the fuck with blues that I fuck with white. Only fuck with white boys that be tell you guys. Such and such and such. Like, that interview he did with her with the Jason Lee show is kind of crazy. I watched a little bit of it. And I'm just, like, disappointed because... I see why I was fighting and always in, in jail. Yo, really be disrespecting sh people just just for comments and likes and the viralness. That shit just disrespectful because it's like, damn, Shorty really went back to you to prove that she fucked with you so heartily. And yo, bitches, literally talking about how you fuck Megan a stallion. Doing, you was that nigga back then. You still that nigga, and nobody get enough credit. <laughs> but woo, his baby. All right, so y'all just saw those two clips. So now if that's not bad enough, of course, Blueface's mama has something to say today, child. She ain't even gotten out of bed yet. She hadn't brushed her teeth. She's literally in bed going live to talk about this situation. So y'all go ahead and check out what Carlisa had to say just an hour ago. Good morning, Saints. Good morning. Mmm, such a good morning. Now, all I want to know is why they didn't come and inbox me and tell me to shut up. Because I would have just shut up. She was supposed to come say, zoop, 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 zoop. And I would have zipped it up so damn quick, girl. You got these people out here talking about you too good for my son. And you know you done got down on your knees. Cute. But that's okay. I still believe in you. You still a stallion. Y'all feel me? Like she was supposed to hit me up and be like, Miss Lady, can you please be quiet? She already knew she had planted her seeds, okay? That girl done knew she already planted her impression on my son. Had him talking in tongues on that last interview, didn't she, y'all? <laughs> 
I'll be on the money. Now, I wonder why Andre, you said, Mom, be quiet. Don't say that. Like, he probably knew something already, too. He going to tell, Andre going to tell me. Don't say that because if he messing around with her, you you making it you you making it look like he be talking too much. I swear to God, I never knew that. I never knew any of that. I just it was just a feeling, a hunch. All right, y'all just heard what Carlisa had to say. This lady is a trip. She is she's funny but weird as hell. Like I feel like she's her obsession with her two sons. It's just weird. And this is coming from me as a boy's mom. I'm not that invested in my boys's, you know personal business like that unless they bring it to me it's just weird that she's so obsessed with what, what her son is doing and who he's doing it with okay with both of her sons it's just very very strange but like I said she wasted no time jumping on live honey she ain't even got up shower brush her teeth nothing she's like I gotta tell y'all I gotta speak on this I gotta give my commentary she's a mess but I just think this whole situation is crazy um I don't know I'm just getting where, like I said this before on my last live stream, it's very interesting that all the bloggers are now like clicking up. All these people who looked at each other as competition, they're all clicking up. It's very, very interesting. It's very interesting that this Meg Thee Stallion tea is being spilled. And now, you know, Jason Lee's asking about it. Adam 22's co-signing it. But the real question is, were any of these people there? Was, Carlisa, were you there? Jason, were you there? Adam 22, were you there? Y'all are just going off of what Blueface said. And we know Blueface, honey, he be over-exaggerating sometimes. I'm not saying that Meg ain't no big old freak. I'm not saying that she didn't possibly hook up with Blueface because we all know that she hooked up with Tori and the baby, And they were all on that freshman album cover together, you know. But with that being said, regardless if she hooked up with this man or not, that is her personal business. What is up with all these grown men being chatty patties? Like, I don't get that. Like, I remember back in the day, you did not kiss and tell. And it seems like now you can't even hook up or date somebody without them just spilling all the tea. But like I've been saying, you know what I'm saying? These dudes be talking more than females, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not shocked at all. But I think y'all need to let that girl heal. Let her live her best life. She's been through enough. And y'all know I'm not no big Meg Thee Stallion fan. Everybody knows that. But I just think it's unfortunate that she keeps getting drugged for her sexual exploits. At the end of the day, everybody that she's with is grown. They're of age. And if she chooses to, you know, sleep with the baby, Tori, Blueface, and whoever else, that is her own personal business. You know, because these same men in the industry smash everything that moves and nobody judges them. But as soon as it's a female, she's a slut, she's a whore, she's this and that. How many people has Blueface slept with? He's literally, he can't even be faithful to Jaden, Alexis, or Krishan. So he has no business even trying to throw shade at Megan at this point. So I just find this entire situation messy, but you know what? <laughs> I'm here for it, bitch, okay? So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Let me know your thoughts on this entire messy situation. Once again, concerning Blueface. Spilling his alleged tea with Meg Thee Stallion. Do y'all believe Blueface? Do you guys feel like Meg Thee Stallion really gave him head? How do y'all feel about Adam-22, you know, basically co-signing what Blueface said? How do y'all feel about what Carlisa had to say about this situation as well? So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. I look forward to reading your comments down below. Please make sure you guys hit this video with a like. Feel free to share the video. Most importantly, make sure you're still subscribed to the channel because what we're trying to get to a million subscribers this year so i will talk to y'all later enjoy the rest of your day deuces if you want the latest news in the streets join us and tune in for the tea breaking news with integrity so sir your friends and your family it's the lovely tv show bringing you good tea and good vibes it's the lovely tv show be sure to share like and subscribe